welcome to my channel. Excuse the chandelier. If I turn it off, there will be no lighting in this video. Anyways, in this video, I will be making slime for the first time. I have watched tons of slime videos, mainly because of how much I love slime and how addicting the videos are. So, I want to try making slime myself and see how it goes. I have never made slime before, but I have watched tons of videos on how to make it. So, I am going to try making slime today. Here I've got clear glue, borax, a bowl, a spatula to mix with, and to decorate my slime, some blue food coloring and some blue and silver glitter. I really hope this works. I have been wanting to make slime for so long, so I really hope this goes as planned. Let's make some slime. First, I'm gonna get one cup of warm water. Next, I'm gonna take half a teaspoon of borax and then mix that in. Okay, now I'm gonna set this aside. Now I am going to empty the entire bottle of glue into the bowl. Ooh, so cool. Gotta get every last drop. Come on, you stupid glue bottle. Come on, you stupid glue bottle. I wanna get all of you out of there. Oh, oh you stupid glue bottle, come on. Now I had just filled up the glue bottle with water and now I'm going to mix this in with the glue. Looking good. Okay, now that there are no more lumps in my mixture, I'm going to start adding the fun stuff. I'm gonna add some blue food coloring to make my slime blue. Here we go. I'll add more later if needed. Now I've gotta stir this in. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. It's such a pretty blue color. This is probably one of the prettiest shades of blue I've ever seen in my life. I don't need to add any more food coloring. This is perfect. Now I'm gonna add my glitter. Now time for the silver. Okay, now let's stir in this glitter. Oh my gosh, that is so gorgeous. That pretty blue color with the glitter, it's so beautiful. That is so sparkly and pretty. This looks like the galaxy, kind of like galaxy slime. Okay, now that I have added my food coloring and glitter, I'm gonna start adding the borax mixture, slowly. This is what's gonna turn it into slime. Here I go. Ooh, it's starting to turn into slime, but I could use a little more solution. There we go. Ooh, so, so gorgeous. Just a little more. It's still not coming together yet, but I'm gonna keep adding this until it comes together. So far, it's working. I hope this works. It's coming together and I'm scared. Oh my gosh, it's already starting to come together. It's almost time to start kneading. Guys, it's almost time to start kneading, but I'm gonna add a little more of the solution. I'm not gonna use all of it because it's already coming together. This is gorgeous slime, oh my gosh. Just one more pour of the borax solution and then and then I'm gonna start kneading it. Ooh, oh my gosh. Look at that guys, it's so pretty. It's it is slime. Oh my gosh. 
This, I cannot believe I'm making slime, oh my gosh. Okay, it's time to start kneading it. Ugh, it's so sticky still, I, I have to knead it. Oh, this feels so good. It's not the stretchiest, but maybe it'll become stretchy. Still, I really like it. It's it's pretty, it's it's squishy. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. It's a dream come true for me. This is so amazing, it's unbelievable. I'm gonna keep kneading it until it's no longer sticky. Hopefully this doesn't turn out to be a fail. I'm gonna keep kneading it until it turns into slime. This is so cool. Oh my gosh. Well, it's it's not the stretchiest, but I but it's pretty cool. Is there a way I can make it more stretchy? It's ugh. Well, I still like it, even if it's not stretchy. I'm pretty sure that dish soap makes this more stretchy, but I wonder if, if I added dish soap to this, it would make it softer and more stretchy. I probably added a teensy bit too much borax solution because it's, it's not the stretchiest, but, but it's pretty stretchy. Well, you can stretch it a little bit, but then it breaks. Ooh, this is so nice. Almost ready to play with. So I'm gonna take a little piece of the slime and try it with, with the dish soap and see if it, uh, and see if it makes it softer and more stretchy. Oh, I think it kind of did. <laughs> This piece is so soft and stretchy now. I'm gonna mix it in with the rest of my slime. Ooh, it's so stretchy now. Well, it still breaks apart. Ooh, so cool. I added a little bit of dish soap and, and it does help a little bit in making it softer and more stretchy. I really like this. I want to do this more often. By the way guys, I'm, I'm not going to be making that many slime videos on my channel because there are already so many slime videos on YouTube. I'm gonna add a teensy bit more dish soap. There we go. Hopefully this doesn't ruin it. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> this is awesome. This is awesome, guys. You've gotta try it. It's so awesome. It's still a little bit sticky, but... Hopefully it won't be sticking anymore soon. Ooh, it's so bouncy. I'm just gonna add a teensy bit more dish soap and that's the last of dish soap I'm gonna add. I'm gonna fold it in. Guys, this is so fun to play with. It's unbelievable. The dish soap makes it kind of sticky, but but it makes it softer and stretchier. I'm almost done kneading it. Ooh, 
so awesome. Ooh. I am so glad I made slime. This is so awesome. This is so cool. This part of the slime doesn't break. That's surprising. It's no wonder slime is so viral these days. It is so fun. You guys have got to try it. It is so fun. Especially for people with autism. It's a great sensory. Now I'm going to put it in this container to uh, sit. If you like this video, please subscribe for more videos on my channel. I post a new video every Friday. If you have any questions or requests for upcoming videos, please comment them down below. Thank you for watching. Bye guys!